Hello friends. Welcome back to channel. Rats A E Square. All about electrical engineering. Today we will see. How to calculate fault current for electrical system. Let's see calculation for following system single line diagram. This system consists of a source of 11 kV and a transformer of 11 kV by 0.415 kV. This system consists of four numbers of motors connected as load, operating at 415 volt. For power transmission 7 runs of 20 meter 400 square mm cable and 1 run 30 meter 400 square mm cable are used. We will calculate fault current for these points. Point number 1 Point number 2 And point number 3 For calculation of short circuit current at point number 1 Available data Line voltage is equal to 415 volt That is 0.415 kV KVA is equal to 2000 and percentage impedance is 6%. Step 1. We will calculate impedance of transformer in ohms from percent impedance using following formula. Impedance of transformer. Z transformer is equal to percentage Z multiplied by 10 and KV square and divided by KVA. Therefore Z transformer is equal to 6 multiply by 10 and 0.415 square and divided by 2000. So Z transformer is equal to 0.005166 ohms. Step 2. Calculate short circuit current at point number 1 using following formula. Short circuit current ISC at point 1 is equal to 1.05 line voltage divided by root 3 and Z transformer. Therefore ISC is equal to 1.05 into 0.415 and divided by root 3 and 0.005166. So ISC is equal to 48.7 kilo ampere. So we can say fault level at point 1 is equal to 48.7 kilo ampere. Calculation of short circuit current at point number 2. Available data. Z transformer is equal to 0.005166. Z cable between point 1 to 2 is equal to 0.0778 ohms per kilometer. Number of runs are equal to 7. And distance between point 1 to 2 is 20 meter that is 0.02 kilometer. Now we will calculate the Z cable by this formula. Z cable is equal to ohms per kilometer multiplied by distance in kilometer and divided by number of runs. So 0.0778 multiplied by 0.02 and it will be divided by 7. So Z cable is equal to 0.00022 ohms. Now ISC is equal to 1.05 line voltage divided by root 3 and summation of Z transformer and Z cable. Therefore 1.05 multiplied by 0.415 and divided by root 3 and summation of 0.005166 and 0.00022, that is 46.1 kilo ampere. So fault level at point number 2 is 46.1 kilo ampere. So we can say fault level at point 2 is 46.1 kilo ampere. Next we will see short circuit current at point number 3. Available data. Z transformer is equal to 0.005166. Z cable between point number 1 to 2 is equal to 0.00022 ohms. 
z cable between point number 2 to 3 is equal to 0.0778 ohms per kilometer. Number of run is equal to 1. Distance between point 2 to 3 is equal to 30 meter that is 0.03 kilometer. Z cable will be calculated in ohms by this formula. Z cable is equal to ohms per kilometer multiplied by distance in kilometer and divided by number of runs. So it is 0.0778 multiplied by 0.03 and divided by 1. So Z cable in ohms is equal to 0.002334 ohms. Now I short circuit is equal to 1.05 line voltage divided by root 3 and summation of Z transformer Z cable point 1 to 2 and Z cable point 2 to 3. That is equal to 1.05 multiplied by 0.415 and divided by root 3 and summation of 0.005166.00022 and 0.002334, which is equal to 33.5 kA. So fault level at point number 3 is 33.5 kA. Following are the different fault levels at different points. 48.7 kA at point number 1. 46.1 kA at point number 2. And 33.5 kA at point number 3. Please do like, share, comment. And subscribe to channel Rats A E Square. All about electrical engineering. Thanks for watching.